Thanks for joining us tonight. I'm Dan Schaefer. And I'm Nikkel Williams. We want to begin with those two young teenagers now facing burglary and criminal mischief charges after breaking into a local church in Lawrence County and vandalizing thousands of dollars worth of property. Way 31's Nicole Zedek spoke to church members who say they aren't resentful after learning the ages of the two suspects. When members of the New Antioch Church of Christ found out it was just two kids who caused all of this damage, they surprisingly weren't angry but instead just feel sorry for their families. My thoughts are really with the tragedies within the family, having to deal and cope with this. Members of the New Antioch Church of Christ are picking up the pieces of their church after 13 and 15 year old boys broke in early Friday morning, tearing TVs off the walls and spraying fire extinguishers throughout the building. Now that church members know it was two kids who caused thousands of dollars worth of damage, they say rebuilding their church is going to be the easy part. We can put a building back together. That's a lot easier than putting a life or a family back together. He wants to remain anonymous until juvenile authorities process the case. He's grateful the Lawrence County Sheriff's Office was able to find the suspects in a matter of days. I want to thank the investigators, the deputies, a particular public for helping us out to solve this case this quickly. Sheriff Max Sanders says investigators identified the kids by using tips from the public and showing video evidence to Lawrence County School resource officers. We depend on the public and the community to help us solve these crimes and we appreciate it. If you see anything, Call us and let us know. You never know what it leads to. He says the two kids are not affiliated with the church in any way, and there's no reason this specific church was targeted. They just walking down the road and decided to break into the church. Church members say this act of defiance won't impact their worship. We're going to have worship, whether it's outside under a tree or in this building or somewhere else. We, nobody's going to keep us from doing that, and that's what we're about. Church members are going to keep cleaning up for the rest of this week, but come Sunday, they plan on holding services once more. Reporting in Lawrence County, Nicole Zedek, Way 31 News. Nicole, thanks. The sheriff's office interviewed one of the suspects on Monday and the other one this morning. Both of them confessed and are now at the juvenile probation office.